Ladies and gentlemen, referee Keith Peterson has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 44 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by submission due to a guillotine choke, Jim A. Ten Mella! Ladies and gentlemen, I'm here with the winner, Jim Miller. What a career you have had, my friend, and you did it again tonight. How good does it feel to do it and do it here in the garden? Uh, it feels amazing. Uh, New York, I got one thing to say first. We need justice for Peanut, right? Like, you know, and it's not just the squirrel. It's all the kids that went hungry that night and all the other things that the money and resources could have been put to. Hopefully that uh, Doge cleans things up down to state level. I, I like how you use your post-victory speech for a for political a rally. But listen, man, what a career you've had. And again, look at this guillotine. I want you to look at it on the big screen because it is a picture-perfect Jim Miller arm in guillotine. He dives in for the takedown. You wrapped him up, jump guard, and that was a wrap. And the compression you had on this was just fantastic. Yeah, you know, uh, I, I figured out the guillotine it's almost 20 years ago now, right? It took a couple of years of jiu-jitsu for me to figure it out. But uh, I have a little bit different approach to my grip, and it, uh, it doesn't matter how long I'm there. I can squeeze for five minutes if I need to. But Jim, you've had such an incredible career. How much longer are you going to keep doing this? There, there's still some tread left on the tires. So, uh, you know, this was 45. Uh, this, this was 45 in the UFC. Let's see if I can make it to 50. You know, uh, that's, the, that's what, 27 wins inside the octagon now? You know, and the funny thing is, Joe, I don't know if you don't know this, I'm not even the top 10 for most decision wins at lightweight. I come in here, I'm always looking for the finish, and I'm happy that could give you guys uh, a good one. Well, I'm always happy to see you, sir. Congratulations, Jim Miller!